Hi YouTubers, welcome to my first DIY tutorial. Today, I'm going to show you how I made this bottle lamp. And these, using the same procedure. My name is Sharon and I am the Uber 6 Day Crafter. Here's a list of items you will need. An old towel that you don't intend to use again on your skin. An empty bottle. Plumber's putty. Safety goggles. A diamond dust hole saw, preferably half inch. A portable drill or a drill press if you have one. A pair of cut resistant gloves. A 50 bulb set of white wire Christmas lights. A glue gun. A length of quarter inch dowel to reach the bottom of the bottle. And a cup screw hook to screw into the dowel. Grab a clump of the putty and roll it to a thickness of about half an inch and a length of five inches. Join the two ends together to form a circle. Place the circle on the bottle around the area in which you intend to drill. Smooth it down against the glass so that when you add water, it will not leak. We first need to drill a hole in the back of the bottle in order to insert the string of lights. Before drilling, Please ensure you have on protective eyewear and you use cut resistant gloves if you have it. The purpose for using the water is to help lubricate the whole saw and remove the debris. Here I am using a drill press with a firm and steady pressure. It took approximately 60 seconds to go through the bottle. After drilling, remove the putty, wash the bottle, and make sure it dries thoroughly before the next step. If using a handheld drill, start the drill at an angle, then slowly move it to an upright position so that the drill bit doesn't wander and scratch the surface. Insert the lights into the hole. Use the dowel with the cup screw hook attached to help pull the lights to the top of the bottle. Continue to insert the remaining lights. Glue the end of the string of the lights to the inner top of the bottle. This will ensure that the lights span the entire length of the bottle instead of dropping to the bottom. Your bottle is now complete. You can also add a base to give it a classy finish. You can decide if you want to add a ready-made base or create your own. I decided to create my own base by using a scrap piece of white pine. I first cut a five by five inch piece of white pine with my mitre saw. 
I then routed the edges using a cove bit on a handheld router. I sanded the base before applying a shoshugi band finish. Now comes the fun part. I'm going to show you how I use this blowtorch to apply a shoshugi band finish to the base. Shoshugi band is a Japanese technique where the wood is burnt on the outward face, then brushed. The heat treatment improves the lifetime of the wood by preventing decay and rot. It also discourages insect infestation. After brushing and dusting off the wood thoroughly, I apply two coats of a spray sealant. The bottom of the bottle was glued to the wooden base using E6000. It was then left for 24 hours to cure. Hope you guys enjoyed this DIY bottle lamp tutorial. If you have learned anything new or may have suggestions as to how I could have done things differently, please post your comments below. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, remember to hit that like and subscribe button. That's all for now. Take care, folks. Bye.